Did you know? There's a silent killer among us, lurking in the shadows. It's the third leading cause of death in the United States. Have you ever wondered what it is? It's time to unmask this foe. Join us as we reveal the hidden truths about pancreatic cancer, the silent enemy that takes countless lives. Pancreatic cancer, often referred to as a silent killer, is the third leading cause of death in the United States. It's a formidable adversary that, despite its prevalence, remains hidden in plain sight. In 2020, the global incidence rate of pancreatic cancer for both sexes combined was 4.9 per 100,000, while the mortality rate was 4.5 per 100,000. Most countries around the world have seen increasing trends in both the incidence and mortality of pancreatic cancer, making it a matter of growing concern. It is estimated that approximately 64,050 people in the United States will be diagnosed with pancreatic cancer in 2023 according to the American Cancer Society. It is slightly more common in men than in women. The high mortality rate of pancreatic cancer is due to the fact that it is often diagnosed at a late stage when the cancer has already spread to other organs, making it difficult to treat. How fast can pancreatic cancer progress? It is estimated that the average T1 stage pancreatic cancer progresses to T4 stage in just over one year. Yes, in just over a year, a tiny T1 stage tumor can evolve into a formidable T4 stage adversary. This fact underlines the critical importance of early detection. The sooner we uncover this silent foe, the better our chances of defeating it. Stay tuned as we're unmasking pancreatic cancer, unveiling its signs, symptoms, risk factors, prevention, and exploring the hope and treatment options. Together, we can fight against this disease and work towards early detection and effective treatment for a better future. The pancreas, a vital organ, plays a central role in our digestive and endocrine systems. It's responsible for producing enzymes that aid in digestion and hormones that regulate our blood sugar. But when pancreatic cancer strikes, it disrupts this delicate balance. Abnormal cell growth in the pancreas leads to the formation of tumors, affecting its vital functions. Let's take a closer look at the 10 key signs and symptoms of pancreatic cancer. Recognizing these early warnings can make all the difference. Number 1. Poor appetite, unintentional weight loss. Many people with pancreatic cancer experience a significant decrease in appetite, often leading to unintentional weight loss. This can be accompanied by feelings of bloating and indigestion. Number 2. Abdominal pain. Pancreatic cancer often causes upper abdominal and or mid-back pain. The pain can vary in intensity and may radiate to the back. It's a common early symptom. Number 3. Back pain. Both pancreatitis and pancreatic cancer can lead to back pain. The characteristics of this pain may differ from abdominal pain and can be indicative of underlying issues. Number 4. Jaundice or itchy skin. Jaundice, characterized by the yellowing of the skin and the whites of the eyes, is a common sign of pancreatic cancer. Elevated bilirubin levels in the blood cause it. Jaundice often leads to itchiness, abnormally dark urine, and pale, clay-colored stools. Number 5. Fatigue. Individuals experiencing any of the above-mentioned symptoms often report increased fatigue. They may become tired more quickly during daily activities or work. Number 6. Late-onset diabetes. Since the pancreas plays a role in regulating insulin levels, some people with a pancreatic tumor develop late-onset diabetes mellitus. Number 7. Nausea and vomiting. Nausea and vomiting can occur when a pancreatic mass presses on the digestive tract. These symptoms can lead to further weight loss, dehydration, and a decrease in appetite. Number 8. Digestive problems. Pancreatic cancer can disrupt the normal functioning of the digestive system. This can lead to difficulties in digesting food properly, resulting in symptoms like indigestion, nausea, vomiting, and an early feeling of fullness, even after consuming small amounts of food. The tumor may obstruct the flow of digestive enzymes from the pancreas to the small intestine. Number 9. 
Changes in bowel movements. Pancreatic cancer can cause changes in bowel habits. This may include experiencing diarrhea or loose stools, or noticing changes in the color of stools, such as pale or greasy stools. These changes result from the disruption of normal digestion and absorption processes in the intestines caused by the tumor. Number 10. Blood clots. Pancreatic cancer is associated with an increased risk of developing blood clots. Cancer cells can release substances that promote blood clot formation, leading to conditions like deep vein thrombosis, DVT, or pulmonary embolism, PE. Symptoms of blood clots may include swelling, pain, warmth, or redness in the affected area, and shortness of breath or chest pain in the case of a pulmonary embolism. Now that we've explored the signs and symptoms, let's discuss the risk factors associated with pancreatic cancer and the steps you can take for prevention. Understanding the risk factors can help you make informed decisions and potentially reduce your risk. Risk factors that can be changed. Number 1. Smoking. Smoking significantly increases the risk of pancreatic cancer. If you're a smoker, consider seeking support to quit. Number 2. Obesity, being obese, with a body mass index, BMI, of 30 or more, is a risk factor for pancreatic cancer. Maintaining a healthy weight through diet and exercise is crucial. Number 3. Diabetes, pancreatic cancer is more common in people with diabetes, especially type 2 diabetes. Managing diabetes through a healthy lifestyle can lower your risk. Number 4. Chronic pancreatitis, a long-term inflammation of the pancreas, is linked with an increased risk of pancreatic cancer. Seek medical guidance for managing this condition. Number 5. Workplace exposure to certain chemicals, heavy exposure at work to certain chemicals used in the dry cleaning and metalworking industries may raise your risk. Protective measures are essential. Risk factors that can't be changed. Number 6. Age, risk increases with age. Number 7. Gender, more common in men. Number 8. Race, different racial backgrounds may influence the risk. Number 9. Family history, higher risk with affected relatives. Number 10. Inherited gene mutations, up to 10% of pancreatic cancers are caused by inherited gene mutations. Genetic testing can identify these risks. Some risk factors can't be changed, but you can take steps to prevent pancreatic cancer. Prevention measures. Number 1. Healthy lifestyle, eat well and stay active. Number 2. Regular checkups, attend regular checkups and screenings. Number 3. Smoking cessation, seek support to quit smoking. Number 4. Manage chronic conditions, work with healthcare providers to manage diabetes or chronic pancreatitis. Now, let's delve into treatment options and the critical role of early intervention in the battle against pancreatic cancer. Detecting the disease in its early stages can lead to more effective treatment and better outcomes. It is important to note that the information provided is general and seeking professional advice is crucial if you have any concerns. Treatment options, number one. Surgery. Surgery may remove the tumor or alleviate symptoms. Consult with a surgical specialist. Number 2. Chemotherapy. Chemotherapy can help shrink tumors and slow cancer progression. Discuss options with an oncologist. Number 3. Radiation therapy. Radiation therapy targets cancer cells. Consult a radiation oncologist. Number 4. Targeted therapy. Targeted therapy medications can block specific cancer cell functions. Seek guidance from an oncologist. Remember, early detection is crucial. Pancreatic cancer can progress rapidly. Time is ticking. You are the best guardian of your own health. Your body sends signals, and you're the one who knows them best. Stay vigilant for any unusual symptoms even those you might be tempted to ignore. Your health is worth paying attention to. Please, don't overlook the signs and symptoms we've discussed today. 
And if you ever experience any other concerning changes, don't hesitate to reach out to your healthcare professional. The sooner it's detected, the more treatment options are available. Be proactive. If you experience symptoms or have risk factors, don't hesitate to seek medical advice. If you found the video helpful, please consider sharing it to support those impacted by pancreatic cancer and to spread awareness about the significance of early detection. Also please support us by subscribing, liking the video, and turning on the notification bell, so that you won't miss our other informative video. Thank you for watching.